the new building looks pretty awesome for where it is and it's been really interesting to see it get built so i am really excited i think the fact that we actually got to see it and that like mostly construction they seal it off but we actually got to see it like kind of just come out of the ground in a way like we saw them lay the gravel and feed the frame to, so it was really interesting to watch it every day and see the transformation i'm very excited of what it's gonna look like inside of the build, new building because there's three different types of buildings and i wonder which one i'm going to be in it's either left or middle some more science no some more math material um, the red bed being so close to us because it's how it's going to be way easier. They don't have to wait and walk across the street. They'll be in the same 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 area as us, so it'll be it will be very easy. Hi, I'm Shelley. I am the lead guide in the Mulberry's lower L classroom, and I'm the elementary team lead. And I am re in terms of the new building, I'm really excited about having a space that's built purposely for elementary age children. I've never had that before, so it's really excited having a space that's where we've really thought about their needs and their development as we've built it. My name is Charlie, and I'm excited about being in my new classroom. Hello, my name is Harrell, and I'm the I think it'll be just good to like create like bonds with each other, you know, we'll all actually be able to because like Upper L has kind of been like pretty far away from like they've been with like the toddlers and the children house. I think it'll just be good for like the adolescents, Upper L, Upper L and Lower L to all be together. I think it'll be like, you know, just good, like the community. Hi, I'm Kate Hicks. I'm the lead guide for the Red Buds community. Um, as some of you know, we had a pretty exciting year with our our classroom being in the gym for a little a while in the fall and now back in, in the little barn. I'm really looking forward to moving into the new building because uh, we'll have neighbors. The ginkgos and the mulberries will be our neighbors and we'll be able to uh, exchange ideas throughout the day and check in with, each, with one another throughout the day and I think that'll be really a comfort and a support. Uh, and I'm also looking to have a, forward to having more space. Perfect. My name's Layla and I'm in the Mulberries. And I'm excited because we're going to have bigger toilets. <laughs> Hi, my name is Tulsi and I'm in the Mulberries classroom. And I'm really excited about the new building because we're going to have bigger bathrooms. Whenever you're ready. Hi, I'm John Pierce. I run the Writer's Workshop for Lower Elementary and also the Outdoor Environment. excited about getting to the new building, having more space, more organization, and eventually getting the outdoor environment over there as well so we can all be in one spot. It's going to be great. For the past two years, I've been in the upper elementary classroom, and then the rest I've been in Little Barn, so I think it's going to be really cool to be able to be in like a whole new environment. Um, I'm also excited, excited about having um, a larger workspace. My name is Mariana. I'm in the It's going to be really fun, especially since the lower L and the upper L are going to be in the same general area. I'm very excited for the new elementary village. Um, it's been a long time coming uh, to put it up since I've been here. I've been thinking about it and the school's been thinking about it. And really, I think in order for us to continue building our elementary program, having this is going to be a huge um, uh, moment for these students, for our community, in order to get them into a really great space provide them with more space and also to have um, the elementary communities coming together as one. Hello, I'm Raquel Davis. I'm an assistant in the Mulberry's classroom and I'm excited about the new building that we're entering in because new things represent new beginnings. So I'm excited about the new beginnings for the children, new things they'll be learning. We're all happy. Ready? Are you excited about your new classroom? Yeah!